Hey, who's there? Who have I got? Hi, Jordan. <laughs> we are, I'm going to share a document with you. Um, I have two other students who are in the Hangout with me, and they weren't able to get into the Hangout. So, um, actually, I think what I can do, I can also um, put on the screen what they're actually typing right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to share a document with you. I'm actually going to share two documents with you. When you go to your Google Drive, you look for shared with me and they'll be there in just a second. So let me let me do that now. Okay, hang on a second. Let me tell my students here what I'm doing. Okay. One minute. Okay. okay. Jordan. Jordan, do you know your six digit number offhand? Yes, it's 489722. 722. There you are. Thank you. And can edit. Okay, so there goes the Google Doc. And then I'm also going to share. I have annotated when crop comes king, and so um, that will show you what um, how I put how I took the rooms apart. Um, give me that number one more time, please, and I'll share this document. Four eight nine seven two two. Okay. Thank you. All right. So if you go into your folder in the Google Drive. Um, Okay. And then you'll see me typing along on the on the um, Google Doc itself. The other one, the PDF is the article. So you can stay on the Google Hangout if you want. You won't hear me very much, but if you have a question, you can just jump in with it. Okay. Go ahead. So, for, okay, this, is it in room? Are you putting it in rooms right now? Um, the Google Doc, or I'm sorry, the PDF is already in rooms. And we're there, we are having a discussion as to why I've picked each of the rooms. So, um, let me just copy and paste this here. So, the document is already showing the rooms and we're talking about why the, I picked them that way. There is no right or wrong answer necessarily. So you want to be careful to, to just figure out what, what seems to be changing. So for example, this five, uh, we, if you look up, where did I go? Um, we did talk about, um, I'm highlighting right now for you, um, the discussion about the rooms why I picked the room between five and six and then seven by itself. So, oops, I just messed up, didn't I? Uh oh, okay. And so right now we're waiting for Cameron to pick the verb. Yeah. Okay. At the bottom of the um, document, there's a um, verb chart. And this is for the do. These are so that you, if you keep that handy, it will tell you about uh, why is the author doing what he's doing. So 
So the rooms are like you can buy them with the rooms where the um uh, the blue highlighter is. Right, yeah, the blue highlighters show where the different rooms are. And how do you know where to find they usually come with some phrases that, um, I, I'm, yeah, I'm in the middle of a Google Hangout. Want to, want to jump on it? <laughs> we are, we are doing, no, I'm sorry. There's another student here in the room. Um, we're doing, what, what assignment number are we working on everybody? 1.4.4. Okay. <laughs> oh, we should be done in about, hopefully, about 15, 20 minutes. Okay. So back to the rooms. Um, if the, the reason that we switched at three and four, I'm starting to get facts now in paragraph number four. The first part, I've also identified where the introduction is. So the pink part that's underlined in paragraph three is the, is the thesis or the major claim. So once he starts adding information to that, that becomes paragraph four. Um, Trying to see if somebody now can. Um, we want to. We want to be careful when we're trying to figure out the do, because we may take too many steps, and we may make too many inferences. Okay, so where it says um, on the Google Docs, I'm because, like I said, you're the only one who could get onto this Google Hangout. We tried; they tried earlier to get onto the Google Hangout. Their computers aren't letting them, so we're having to do this all through Google Doc. So they can't hear us right now. It's just you and me talking. So that that's why I'm doing it this way. So, um, okay. Now, let me see. What can I get rid of? By the way, all of the corrections that I make are recorded. So if I erase something that you need to see later, you can go back to the editing to see it, but I'm going to keep this. Um, I, I'll tell you what, I'll just keep what we've got so far. And um, that way you can kind of go through since you were jumping in a little bit later. So hope if, and if you have any questions, just go ahead and ask them. Like I said, it's just you and me in the hangout. So, all right, so the next part, the do and the say, um, I usually recommend that people do the say part first. Um, so go ahead and read paragraph seven in the article. And then I'm also gonna ask this question. Why do you think I stopped at paragraph eight. Why is this not part of the same room?
Yeah. Stop talking about what? Good. Okay. So do you see Jordan Wall why also, in fact, I'll go ahead and write this down too. Um, it started with a question and questions usually indicate a, a transition. Okay, so um, read the paragraph seven, and then what is this paragraph basically saying? Okay. I wish I knew how to scratch a line out. So basically, it's just saying that our, our diet, our eating diet is based on corn. Well, it's adding to that. I, if if the paragraph above has already said that it's made our diets worse, then this one comes along and it says um, that, you know, especially that high fructose corn syrup, that's the one that has, you know, if, it, if corn is being overproduced, it gives us this high fructose corn syrup, which means that like Pepsi-Cola, they had they actually went back and said we use real sugar again why did they do that because too many of these sweeteners have gone to this corn based um fructose and that's less healthy than sugar well it's less healthy than a lot of things so with your says statement that's uh that's what you're basically going to put so let's see um Sorry, we'll take a moment to read these. Okay. What happened up here? Where are we? I'm lost. <laughs> okay. 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 Yes. Um, 
What did I do? <laughs> he messing up. Okay. How are you doing, Jordan? I'm kind of stuck. <laughs> okay. You have a single paragraph. It's going to be super easy. What did I just tell you? What did I tell you what this was about? And, and the manufacturers have changed to that, right? So the manufacturers have changed the way they sweeten things and that has become unhealthy for us. Um, let's see. Um, and actually, if we look at that last sentence by turning us into an expanding race of corn eaters, we could just talk about how this is how uh, the majority of our diet can be made up of corn. That's it, that's all you need to say. So if you put in the majority of the of our diets is now comprised of corn based products you've got it Well, you, uh, okay, you're going to go corn syrup based products? Yes. Yes, why? <laughs> why? I know, that's a terrible word, isn't it? <laughs> right click, right click on the word. You right click on the word, then it should pop up with suggestions on how to spell it. Are you using a, oh, there you go. Okay, good. The problem with Chromebooks is you can't exactly right click, so. Okay, just get the, here you go, and period, and you are done. There we go. So I'll make this one blue. Got to make sure all the blue is showing up as this is the completed product. I've been using too much blue. So. Okay, I'm going to take this out. This out. Okay. Now, Go ahead and read eight, eight, nine, and ten. Oh, boy, somebody's pretty demanding. <laughs> you, no problem. <laughs> Got some eager Avon lady there.
I'm sorry. No problem. Uh, you just have a really eager Avon lady. That's all I know. <laughs> mm -hmm. that was my sister bugging me. Uh, okay. So hopefully everybody's rereading 8, 9, and 10. Let's see what Amaya's going to do. <laughs> the hard part is when you ask a question, they don't understand your question. <laughs> I just needed to know if that was the do or the say. Okay. 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 Looks like a good say to me. So the um the pink highlighted one? Yeah, um, you can tell who's writing what because the line underneath, like if you look up at the top of your picture, I don't know if, no, you probably can't see your own picture, but for me, it's got purple. Amaya's is kind of pink and then Cameron's is blue. You have purple. <laughs> I don't know what my color is. Mine is pink. Mine is pink. Okay, good. Uh oh, there goes Jordan. Oh, I guess it wasn't you. Somebody's joined us. Who's joined us? Let me see. Um, I just heard the signal that somebody left, but you're still here, so never mind. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, we could do transformed our diets into something I don't know if you can see where I'm try what I'm trying to get to here on this sentence because what's the difference between what was going on in seven and now what's going on in eight through ten. Yeah, our diets. They, they, they're mentioning obesity, they're mentioning type 2 diabetes. So 
not only is it changing the way we're eating, but it also changes our health because it's now more what? Harmful. harmful. There you go. Go ahead and type harmful for them. One L. There you go. All righty. Now I'm going to make this blue. And that's awesome. I will put awesome. Oop. <laughs> that looked like a bad word there. <laughs> okay. okay. Um, so I'm going to see if these guys can finish. Uh, well, let's see. How much more do we have to go? We only have two more, two more to go, and the last one's going to be easy. So going to take all of this off and we're going to go paragraph 11. Can you see Jordan why I made 11 its own? What's going on in 12 that makes it different from um, 11? Why is 12 not part of the same? Well here I'll pose this question in, to everybody else. Okay. Yep. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> she just showed me something. Both 11 and 12 talk about the chemicals. Eleven and twelve, doesn't it? Yes. Yeah. So why are two different rooms? Because I got it wrong. They are in the same room. Why is it that they're in the same room? Because they both talk about the same. Mm hmm. Yep. Okay, what can we say about those chemicals? Perfect. Except she needs a period. <laughs> you want to put the period there for me, please, Jordan? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. So. <laughs> just say your homework. <laughs> Who's that? My brother. My brother. <laughs> so I can just pick any one of these 
the, the one that makes the most sense there, yep. Except states, we need to scratch that off. Um, can you get my phone, please, Brooke? It's Greg. Thank you. Okay. Reflex describes. What about Cameron? Let's see here. Well, go ahead. If you want to change it, you can. <laughs> We're going to pick one. Everybody gets to pick one, and then we'll pick the best one. <laughs> there she goes. Come on, Cameron. <laughs> I'm messing with her head. <laughs> she looking, I'm no, she's looking. Okay, let me do this then. If we are going to, ah, here we go. Proposes, ooh, okay. What would be the rest? What's he doing here? And you might consider the tone words he uses the ones that I've circled because I found that this was really where he's he's starting to go for that pathos jugular the polluting machine that guzzles fossil fuel <laughs> so how demabining those corn strops are <laughs> okay yes all right so i'm gonna say you may place your own verb if you wish, or shall we vote? All righty. Okay. Um, okay. I'm not sure if he does this. He, you, he doesn't really do that here. But he does infer that they cause a lot 
of problems. Okay. All right. So now we're going to go to the last one, paragraph 13. This one's easy. They're in the same room. Yeah, that's what we, because um, like you said, they're both talking about the chemicals that we use. So, so they should be in the same room. What does the last paragraph always do? What's the purpose of anybody's last paragraph? That's right. So where's that going to go? <laughs> okay. Is it do or say? Right, so go ahead and start typing that. Concludes the argument. Argument. Mm. Right click. Right click on the word because it's underlined. The argument. Right click on that because you see the um, the little red squiggly line under argument. Right click on it and then, then fix it. Okay. The green thing is grammar. The um, it it um, grammar is you know do you have a comma or is there a uh, agreement problem, something like that. Red is always a spelling. Oh, I see what you meant by that. You did the suggesting. You were doing the suggesting. If you go up to the top where it says editing, if you or it'll say suggesting. If you change that to editing, then it then it won't do that. There you go. Okay. Whoops. She's still working. <laughs> All righty. Maybe I should have just let her fix it. Okay, I'll stop. There we go. <laughs> okay. Man, we'll make this one blue. And we are done. Okay, so what you want to do is uh, submit this document as your assignment. And keep it as a reference. All the comments. So if you're ready, Jordan, you are ready to go. Are there any other questions that you have, though? Yeah, hopefully at that point. Now let's see. So, so this is the this is the pollen, and the next one is the barbosa, right? Yeah. Okay. 
So, and I will tell you on the Barboza that um, those are a little bit smaller rooms because he's writing for a newspaper. Um, there will be some rooms that are just one paragraph long. There'll be others that could be three, four, even five paragraphs long. So you just have to figure out where everything's changing. And I, there is no answer key. So, you know, I can't, anybody can make the argument, well, this is where the room is. That's why you were able to tell me that 11 and 12 were the same room because they are talking about the same thing. So if you find yourself typing something, um, let's see, I shouldn't be reading and talking at the same time. Um, if you're finding yourself writing the same thing for the do and the say, then they're in the same room. So as long as you're doing different things for the say and the do, then, then you're fine. Okay. Let's see here. Um, uh, you use the same computer as your mom, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. In fact, that's what I'm going to be teaching. There's three things that I do uh, that I do teach you, and then I do them all at once. I've I've gotten to the point where I can do them all at once. So um, let's see. Um. So. Yes, when you're annotating, now that you know what the rooms are, it's probably a really good idea to, um, yeah. Okay. Any other questions? All righty. Well, um, I'm going to be answering some questions here. So if you think of anything, uh, if you, as long as you see my little picture up at the top, I'm still on this document. Okay. All right. Thanks, Jordan. All right. Bye-bye. to um Okay, so